Well, ladies and gentlemen, people have had enough of this lockdown. Do you know why we're coming out of lockdown? Do you know why the government are releasing us? Why Daniel Andrews just released us in Victoria? Because we've fucking had enough. People are coming out anyway. You know, we've had enough of this bullshit. So that's what we're going to talk about tonight. A report from Tiger Mountain. Lockdown end. That's it, ladies and gentlemen. We've had enough. Australians have had enough. Americans have had enough. People in the UK have had enough. We've had enough of this fucking bullshit. We've had enough of lock being locked down over the fucking flu or, you know, maybe something a little bit more virulent than the flu. You know, so uh, basically the people of the Western world, you know, have decided we've had enough. And um, obviously our governments are letting it, letting out because essentially they can't control us. You know what I mean? I mean, when the people decide the lockdown is over, it's over. You know, so uh, it, it's interesting, though, but it's very interesting to note the kind of totalitarian, um, you know, excesses that have gone on in, in this uh, stage of lockdown the past couple of months. I mean, I think probably one of the most famous examples of um, overreaction was uh, the terrible video that was on uh, Facebook where there was a woman, Renee, and she was there with her young child. I can't remember her second name, but her, her case is famous. And she's walking down the street wearing a placket. Maybe I think she'd been at a protest or... Um, uh, she participated in a protest, I think, I think she was going home. And for whatever reason, this female police officer comes over to her and starts to hassle her. And it's clear they wanted to make an example of her. And, um, and I guess they did. I mean, you know, she basically uh, pleaded, look, you know, I don't want any trouble, you know, just let me go. And, and for whatever reason, I think they let her go for a minute and then they decided to come back and grab her or something. But basically, there was this whole scene where they're separating her from her child, you know, and the child is crying, mommy, mommy, you know, like the child doesn't know what's going on. I mean, you know, and it's terrible. I mean, I've had people all over Facebook, left wing, right wing, libertarian, anarchist, anarchist even like, you know, even people who are in Antifa are offended by this fucking thing. So, you know what I mean? Like, it's like, it's, it's ridiculous. Um, it was a terrible overreach by, I, I think, Victoria... Was it Victoria? No, it was New South Wales Police. Anyway, Australian Police. And um, it's just... It, this goes to show, you know, and you often wonder why they would do something like this. Possibly the reason they do it is because they want to teach uh, a lesson, you know what I mean? And also want to see how far they can do, go. I think one of the points uh, David Thrussell makes in the video where we talk about um, what's the crisis, he makes the point where, you know, they, they want to see how far they can push this. And I think maybe a video like this is about that, you know. And I think we should all, you know, say a, a resounding no. This is in, in, inappropriate behaviour. Um, it's just not, not Australian, you know, it's un-Australian um, to arrest a child and their mother uh, for attending a rally. And how did the Guardian report on, on, that, on that particular demonstration? They called it a dickheads doing dickhead stuff. Now, can you imagine the Guardian reporting on, say, uh, a, a protest in favour of refugees if they reported on it as dickheads doing dickhead stuff? And the weird thing about these protests, too, is you're seeing an amazing political alignment. People from all across the political spectrum, from, like, the far right, who are, and often libertarians, uh, are protesting against lockdown, but then you've got people on the far left who are protesting against it, who are now on the same fucking side. So this is showing a kind of, like, uh, that really it's just the people versus the globalist um, elite and their enablers. Their enablers are obviously the media, the political elites, uh, and uh, some, you know, elements of big business elites and stuff, you know, are enablers in this class. So, you know, it's quite shocking what's going on, and um, I, I, I just like to condemn that video, and I, I'd like to condemn it on behalf of the report from Tiger Mountain and the Unshackled. This is just fucked up behaviour from Australian police, and it's inappropriate. Don't arrest a mother walking down the street with her child and create such a horrible scene. That video went international and sends out a terrible image of our country. So that's all I wanted to say on the report today. Thank you.